To welcome to the ring one of the legends that paved the way for all of us involved with American independent wrestling. Please welcome the founder of Chicago Pro Wrestling, Lightning Mike Quackenbush. Now you can stand up and applaud. This is a reason to applaud Mike Quackenbush, the founder of Chicago Pro Wrestling, a wrestling visionary, a technical master, man of a thousand holds himself. I'm excited. Mike Quackenbush, special guest of Major Basin here tonight. Well, this guy has a resume that's very impressive. We'll see what he's doing here at NWL. I think you should pay attention. You can learn a thing or two from this guy. Got a new book out too, by the way. Thank you very much for that. I'm certain, uh, based on the rhythmic chanting of my last name, that some of you are familiar with me. I don't doubt that a few of you uh, are not familiar with me. I was an active professional wrestler for a period of about 20 years. Uh, and I was asked to come here today by Major. He's been very, very gracious to me. Not only has he extended me some surprising authority over the card, but he gave me this time to come out and talk about my podcast and my new book, which just came out last month. And, oh, which is all really good. Thank you, you for that. We like books. We like books. Oh, I like books, too. I do. And that's all well and good. But I think I would rather speak about something else, if that's all right. Uh, I had the chance to sit just up there through the first half of tonight's card. And especially since I retired from the ring, I am fairly inactive these days. I don't get out very much. I have my own facility in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It's called the Wrestle Factory. He's a busy man. He's a busy man. Of course, uh, I'm deeply involved in the running of Chikara, and I am content not to travel like I once did. But I was really struck by this. Watching from upstairs, one, I felt very inspired by what I saw the wrestlers doing here in the ring. And it was also very heartwarming to me to watch all of you and the way that you have taken to NWL, which is a fairly new experiment in wrestling. It's only been around about a year. You may know this. Uh, what I have been especially Are you inspired paying attention? by I am. is the level of professionalism I've seen backstage and the care that they take for the professional wrestlers. It's a hot mic. It's, it's a, a hot mic. Hot. They take really wonderful care of the wrestlers, and I want you to know why that's important to me. When I first started in wrestling in 1994, I worked in the Pittsburgh, Eastern Ohio, and rural West Virginia areas. Sometimes I wrestled in barns. I once wrestled in a civic center that was completely empty. <laughs> and the first guy that ever hired me was ultimately busted by the FBI at the end of a 15-year investigation into car fraud. Wow, what a story. Sounds typical. When I contrast my experience starting out as a wrestler with what I have seen here this afternoon and tonight, I feel inspired. Did you know the NWL actually offers the wrestlers health insurance? That's true. You get it? Not man? even the WWE oh, does that. Not even the supposed industry leader does that. It's true. Oh, yes. Right when Mike was starting to get to his, his, his podcast, his book, here comes how, this guy. How could you be upset when Buddy comes at any time? Buddy Shevin with the gold cake. He's out here. I can't believe this guy. This guy makes me sick. Buddy doesn't need no health insurance. Buddy, buddy. He's always so happy and just full of life. There's no way he'd ever have any kind of injuries or any kind of medical problems. Nobody wants to join the buddy system, especially not my quack. Hey, guy. you know what? Quack seems pretty happy, but you can always get happy and the buddy system will bring it to you. Oh, now he's got a mic. Great. I don't think I will, mega buddy. Yeah. Mr. Quackerbush, my name Quack is Buddy Shepard. Pleasure is all mine. Now, for those that don't know, yourself included, I am the founder of the Buddy System. That's right, buddy. Woo! It's called a, it's I a was pyramid scheme. My buddy. No, it's now, not. It's a Ponzi scheme. I've listened to your podcast 
KFAM 2.0. I've subscribed them. All the ways to subscribe. You have to figure it out for yourself. Thank you very much. Buddies will know what to do. KFAM 2.0. Great podcast. I've read your book. And if I may present it, it's right here. Go ahead and get that. Seven keys to becoming a better performer. Now, unfortunately, this book isn't for these people. It's for professional wrestlers. That's right. Much like you used to be. Yes. But unfortunately, you're forgetting the eighth and most important key. I didn't realize. Do I tell, Mr. Shepard. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Quackabush. The eighth and most absolutely important key to becoming a better performer is to let the buddy system come into you. That's so if you just want to get a Sharpie that helps. or whatever, you can just write that in the last page. That's true. Now I know I'm going to give this to, to Midnight Guthrie because, well, he can't read. There you go, buddy. <laughs> he won't, he'll, he'll think it's a coloring book. He's got Archie comics over there. Uh, no, he just doesn't understand good English. Now what I'm also I here to do, hey, Mega Buddies, if you don't be quiet, Mr. Quackerbush and I will leave and we'll never come back. It's Quackenbush. He has to get it right. It's Quackenbush. Oh, it, it's just a southern accent. But get off. listen, uh, your system I know very little about, <laughs> other than it must come with amazing capes. It does, but it also comes with amazing t-shirts. Because tonight, Mr. Quacker Bush, I'm proud to offer you a spot in the body system. It's a tank top, so you can go ahead and flex those guns. Do it. There you go, buddy. Do it. Yes. Blow your nose I on think it he's and accepted. throw it in his face. I think he's accepted. He took it. Woo! Woo! Yeah. This is all very nice, buddy, but thank you. I think I'll pass. No thanks, buddy. What? Yes. Ah, I'm sorry. Maybe. The cape's coming off now. <laughs> Mr. Quacker Bush. Uh, no, don't give it to them. They don't deserve it. No, there's a whole lot of nega buddies that I'm seeing right there. I'm looking right at them. They're very negative here against Bucks. I'm offering you the chance to be a part of the greatest system on any green earth. So go ahead. I'll give you a second chance. Go for it, Mr. Quackerbush. Thank you, Shepard. Yes. The answer is no. Yes. That is, that is not a smart decision. Thank you anyway. This is a man who made his own way in our great sport. He Buddy doesn't Shepherd. need Buddy Shepard to help him out with anything. I don't think you understand the situation that you're in, son. I'm not asking. Now I'm telling that you are about to let Buddy come into you. Quack Do it. Quackenbush will, will tie him up like a pretzel. Buddy, I don't know if you were listening, I but wasn't. I mentioned uh -huh. that Major was kind enough to give me a small measure of authority over the card, so I think I would like to exercise it right now. I know you said you weren't very active, but if you're ready to throw down, by my stars and garters, I'll throw you down. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> no, buddy, can't be serious. I'm not, I'm not going to throw, throw down with you, but a guy I saw this afternoon in my seminar who impressed the heck out of me might, and his name is Sharkbait. Yes! What? Heck yes! Anthony Sharkbait Gutierrez, one of our uh, first graduates of the NWL TPC. I, I, this is great. This could be a great matchup. And Quackin' Bush, look at the smile on his face because he knows Sharkbait's about to teach a lesson Wrestling to Buddy Shepard. Buddy Shepard's opponent tonight. He's a professional of both the ranks of pro wrestling and mixed martial arts. Give it up for Anthony Sharkbait Gutierrez. This is, this is stacked in the favor of Quacker Bush and it's Shark Quackin Bait. Bush. Will you? This is horrible. What? Buddy's not ready to fight tonight. Well, he was apparently ready to fight.
quacking Bush, well, not gonna, quacking he's gonna Bush. Take, uh, he's gonna take him out just because he doesn't wrestle anymore. The, the bell sounded, we are underway. Sharkbait taking on Buddy Shepard. He's not backing down, he's not backing down. Look at, he seems pretty cocksure of himself here. Come on. Oh, God, he just what? kicked him oh, in the buddy. side of the head. He's out. Buddy <laughs> Shepard is snoring. Oh, my goodness. And that's it. The Boy wrestling fans, your order by technical knockout. Anthony Sharpbait Gutierrez. This is a Travis, this is a joke. This is no justice. Buddy Shepard hasn't moved a muscle. This is fantastic. This is the best match I've ever seen on NWL TV. Yeah, but that's stupid of you to say. You know that. Why, why, why would you say that? The poor Buddy was he getting the first shot. I mean, could that guy be any tougher, any braver? Somebody give Buddy Shepard a pillow. He's out. Sharpie 